Thanks, Jeff. Well, er <laughs> fans, fans love you here, even in New York. Your, your Korean fan club has joined us here at City Field. But, Eric, you were on base four times last night. Just what clicked for you last night that carried over here tonight? Another great night for you at the plate. Uh, for me, it was our last day at the home stand, and um, I said, okay, I'm not going to do any more weight training. I'm just going to stretch. I have to get my legs better. Um, you know, so I stretched my quads a lot more, my hip flexors and hamstrings, obviously, because, you know, the opposite muscle groups. Um, and then, yeah, so I started to feel better. Like, when I would swing, it wouldn't hurt as much. And, I mean, like, you know, as you guys know with baseball, it's like all the power comes from the ground up. So, you know, when my hamstring was messed up, I got throw all my power comes from my hips and everything. So it's starting to feel a lot better. I'm moving around. Um, on that triple last night, I was able to kind of, like, open it up and see how it felt, and it felt great. And even tonight, you know, I ran a little, I ran pretty hard, and there's no pain. So I feel like it's a, it's a good uh, stepping start, a stepping stone uh, to, to move on to uh, tomorrow and uh, the rest of the season. Speaking of the power, it was your first home run tonight oh. since May 9th. How good did it feel just for how much you've had to grind through, you know, the strep throat and, and the injuries with your legs as well? Yeah, you know, it's been, it's been a grind, but that's life. You know, that, that's baseball, so you have to uh, you grind through it, and uh, eventually the storm will pass. But I was more pumped about last night with the, the triple. You know, I saw something on MLB Network, and it was like I mean, 0 for 37, or 3 for 37, no extra base hits. And I hit that triple, and I was just like, oh, finally, like, not that's a uh, ball at the end of the bat single, you know, but actually get something extra bases. And it's good for the team. I mean, with Hazy's behind me and Shaw, I mean, like the RBI guys. So if I get a uh, uh, scoring position, then it's a good shot for them to drive me in. What about the guy in front of you, Eric Sogard, on base all four times, just to have that kind of production from the leadoff spot? Yeah, you know, I'm not very surprised because because uh, Sogi is a professional player. You know, he's just he comes to work every day, very even keel, same demeanor every day, whether he's hot or cold, it doesn't matter. And I feel like you know that, that's what makes a special ball player, especially as a leader. He's an older guy. Um, they, they, everybody loves him. He's our, he's a leader for us. So for him at the top of the order or in, lower in the order or wherever, I feel like he always produces. All right. Thanks. Congratulations. Congratulations on a great night. Thanks.